Hello, I'm Kezia, also known as Les Cogumelos, and I thought about talking about the process of the, my, my next work in a little different way, because of course, like a former cinema student, I do love storytelling, and for this piece I thought about talking about the process more in the context that it was made. So for that, I'm going to show some images of places that I went and I was living and how um, this, this piece impacted me and marked a period of my time, of my life. <laughs> It's crazy how unpredictable things happen and we have to change our direction and life's different depending on the direction we go. So that was what happened. I totally by chance went to to this place, a tree house for two weeks and it's a very it was a very incredible and surprising experience <laughs> it was very quiet and peaceful uh, even though it was a hostel and had like many people and travelers um, most of the time the afternoon it was very quiet and felt really good to be there to, to be creating and observing nature and I had, I made some great friendships, um, had amazing talks, and took some medicines, which was very special and and very incredible experience. I didn't make that much um, videos from the place. It was full of art very inspiring but i hope you can feel a little bit the the atmosphere When the two weeks were ended, I went back to the big city, Rio de Janeiro, and I had uh, rent a Airbnb there for one month, but I didn't know where it was going to, to be. I didn't know that it was the most um, energetic place of the entire city. And again, it was a surprise and a very um, different state and, and atmosphere from where I was before. So it was kind of shock, but at the same time, um, gave me a lot of thoughts. And for me, the most inter interesting thing about it that I want to talk about is the fact that creating this piece, I started in the tree house and the, the part of the painting, I did all there and then started animating when I was already in the big city. So it was kind of a central point to me to continue in that same peace of mind that I was before while I was in nature because it's something that um, 
I think it's very important to think about and to to exercise to be to be in peace even though the outside world is totally a mess. You know, you can hold up yourself even though things are like loud and and violent even and we can you know see things in a more clear way and not very passionate um yeah uh, it, that's a bit of of the, of the feeling that there's a lot of to to be said actually about this but it is getting very long i'm sorry <laughs> and thank you for listening um, so i start this piece thinking about not to think about actually like to just feel it and without a concept and all the moments that i were going to to animate i was trying to put me in a state of tranquility you know like or even if my mind was was kind of busy i was trying to to channel some good thoughts and good vibes and <laughs> the famous good vibes yeah um so it was a very part work for me because you know it was like meditating it was help me to to be to be calm and I was doing it at morning which was way better like it was very silent even in the street and yeah it's it's a healing piece I like to to think about and I hope you can feel it and uh, I don't know uh, how my goals how my work is going to to be from from now like it was a very different experience for me process of creating and but it's a journey that i'm very excited to take um and yeah thank you so much for listening uh it's crazy to be talking like uh in this depth i think even though i could say a lot more i think it's it's good for now it's been a while since i last made a piece with sound and for this one i i made a collab with a friend that i met in the tree house and it was such a pleasure to to be able to hear he playing and i started a piece just a few hours after and I thought it made sense to, to call him and ask to collab and to make the sound for this for this work because I think we shared a lot of the the moment there and the feeling when the art was was born. And yeah, I'm very honored and happy to have him with me in this in this work. And yeah, thank you so much for listening.